know what? If it fits me, I mean, we can share. And may I just say, honey, you chose well. If we were in the women's wear section and we checked out with three tees and a pair of shorts, do you know how much that would cost us? Probably three fifty. Yeah. Anyway, so you men are getting a tax break in your fashion. Why have I not tried men's wear sooner? Lovely ones, loyal viewers, new subscribers, and welcome back to my channel. And uh, today I thought I would do a little bit of a fun one. So my husband uh, needs to update his wardrobe like yesterday. The poor man has been very unsuccessful in finding some clothes uh, that he just likes really and he has quite a particular style he's not really into the sort of dirty rustic look he likes very clean sharp kind of dressing not like scott dissy kind of dressing that's very very elevated sharp um <laughs> something like low-key uh casual accessible but still clean crisp that kind of thing um so we're going to roam the shops so I might take a little bit of footage out there and I thought it would be really fun to just push that boat out I mean I'm already discovering or have discovered my personal style and I thought it'd be really fun to just style up some menswear I mean I know a lot of women do shop in the menswear section and are really successful um so I'm really curious about this so my aim is to basically put my husband's style into my own little in my own little way on myself and see how it looks i mean why not let's see how we can style this up hopefully we can make it work so i'll take you through my outfit of the day i might do my hair later but at the moment it is chucked up in a bun i've got some old chains here i think these could be mng that i got from the iconic and just a simple chain bracelet from ioza some very large hoops and some very colorful um, bangles which is the set that I got from Sports Girl many years ago and then on my tootsies I have my Los Cabos shoes um, which is great to be taking them out again and enjoying them in the sunshine with some fresh toes and my Loewe basket bag and this ladies and gentlemen is the outfit of choice for today well, let's get to it Ooh, we have some eager people down there screaming. Okay, let's go. We are back and uh, all the mask wearing has made my uh, lipstick a rub off, which is no surprise. So I'm just going to touch it up now. This Aldi lip gloss in the peachy color tastes exactly like marshmallows. It doesn't quite smell like marshmallows, but when you put it on, mmm. Like a marshmallow in the mouth, guys. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, enough of that. Now, let's get to my husband's little clothing haul. And I did pick up a little something for myself. Practical things for the holiday. Oh, by the way, did I mention, yes, this is um, before we go away. So we have a few options. Without further ado, this is what my husband got. And I got a few things for myself as well. Just practical things whilst I was there. So I'm going to take those and put them aside. He picked up this lovely stripy shirt from Country Road. Um, just in a light blue and white stripe, which I thought was very, very becoming. Again, linen good quality you really can't go wrong with country road then he also picked up these lovely shorts from there and they have this little floral design on them so this little orange 
stamens in the middle. I thought that was very, very cute. Then he also picked up in this bag a lovely linen jacket, which I will try on for you. And I'm kind of jealous because I want a good linen jacket and it's been really hard to get my hands on one. So I was like, damn, son, you know. <laughs> anyway, you know what? If it fits me, I mean, we can share. We share everything else. We might as well share clothing. I mean, why not? <laughs> I don't know how he'll feel about that. Anyway. Then we did a bit of a haul at Maya, and so this is from, I think we did mainly industry when we were at Maya, so we found these shorts, which I picked out, so I'm very proud of, which are a lovely floral design. We also found some really good basics, because we wanted some teas, so we found this really light blue tea, pink one or a salmon colored one in the same design, just a crew neck, and then another basic white tea, really, really thick good quality, breathable cotton, fantastic. And we went to Neverland, which sounds very Michael Jackson or Elvis Presley, whoever lived there first, anyway. And my husband found, found quite a few things, again, very like summer wear, so he found uh, this t-shirt in just a basic beige which, with a nice logo and some on the back here. And this is by a brand called American. American, it must be French. Oh, American Paris. Well, there you are. Then you've got the Nomadic Paradise. I've never heard this brand before. I picked this out as well because I felt like the charcoal is a really good staple colour because it's not black, it's not grey, it's just sitting right in the middle. Then he also picked up a singlet, which is again by American. Same colour, got a nice big A on the back, um, which does a lot for the shoulders. And then lastly, he picked up this nice pair of I'd call like a what kind of a pink, like a clay pink short. So I'm going to try this all on for you and uh, see how they go. Okay, so look number one is this very, very cute little uh, striped shirt, board short moment. And I've just unbuttoned it from the middle just to give it a bit of a feminine touch there. And uh, I do have to say one thing that you know I'm very unfamiliar with in the menswear is that this uh, short situation comes with some mesh. So there is some mesh inside these shorts and apparently uh, it gives men the ability to uh, free ball so not wear any underwear um, which you men out there would know about um, if you don't want to do that. So there's like a mesh undie in there which is a bit uncomfortable for me personally uh, as a woman. But apart from that I'm really digging this vibe and you know what I could totally get away with wearing this on you know on the street. Quality is amazing. This is both from Country Road, lovely linen shirt right up my street. I actually have just returned a linen shirt that I was intending to take with me um, on our little vacation. So I'm kind of thinking I'm going to steal this. I mean, even it opened up with a little singlet underneath. Honey, we've got an outfit. Now I'm going to be trying on the next outfit with you. Okay, so this is look number two and I am definitely stealing my husband's blazer. This is a linen blazer from Country Road and may I just say, honey, you chose well if you are watching, which he doesn't really, he just flips through it. I'm wearing this with a little crop top from Cotton On, it's like a sweetheart uh, neckline and just some nobody denim jeans with a three quarter uh, hem and some alias May heels. But this jacket with the shoulder pads is just so fantastic. I'm sorry, but I am just now opening up to a world of possibility with the menswear. I am not used to feeling like this in menswear. I mean, not that I often delve into that area, but I'm definitely considering it now that it fits so well and just so on trend. So well done. Well done, husband is all I can say. Okay, guys, this is look number two. And uh, this is a tank top. Um, in the menswear section, these are my own jeans. And at the back, it has this wonderful A. Um, which is great if you want to make your shoulders look a bit poppier, which I don't because I have plenty of shoulder to go around. 
Um, I do like the extended sleeve on the side. However, I'm not a huge fan of the gaping hole on the sides there. It's very in for dudes, not so much for me. But from the front, this is quite a nice little singlet moment here, guys. I mean, I'm really comfortable. And on a hot summer's day, having the breeze come through, woof, and loving the beige color as well. So it's a tick from me. Excuse the uh, addition of the lighting in the scene here, guys, because we are lacking a bit of light. It's become later in the day. Now, these are a cute little pair of shorts my husband picked up from industry. And then I've paired it with this t-shirt from Americaine, uh, which he picked up at a store called Neverland. And again, super comfy. It still has that mesh crotch situation, which is not very comfy for me, but if you're a girl, you could simply cut that off if you want it to be a bit more comfortable down there. And it's got a little slogan, uh, at the back but very cool I'm honestly I'm digging this this is very comfortable and are uh, the colors again the lovely beige the charcoals the florals I mean are we sure this is menswear and if it is you're ticking all the boxes well done to the designs out there you're ticking everyone's boxes right now especially mine clearly Okay, and this is the relaxed tee from Industry, and I just paired that with my own Lee denim shorts, and this is in a nice sky blue color. Again, super relaxed, lovely long sleeves. Great protection from the sun if you wanted to wear this to the beach, but even just as a basic, guys, I'm, I'm feeling this. Why have I not tried men's wear sooner? Oh my goodness, anyway fantastic if you're looking for a great quality tea at a very cheap price oh I mentioned to the sales girl there by the way I was checking out for my husband and he bought three t-shirts and a pair of shorts and guess how much it cost him $159 now ladies if we were in the women's wear section and we checked out with three tees and a pair of shorts do you know how much that would cost us probably $350 yeah Anyway, so you men are getting a tax break in your fashion, let me tell you, because they're taxing it up on the women's wear side, let me say. And I have done a little pink on pink moment here, guys. So these uh, items are both from industry, and this is like a, it's very rose, a very rose pink tee with a clay pink or terracotta short, very relaxed and very comfortable so I thought I would pair that with some cushy slides and you've got a lovely casual comfortable breathable day wear look and lastly this is a top by uh, Nomad Nomad Paradise which I think he picked up from I chose this one actually from Neverland and did it with the terracotta shorts cushy slides and that is the end of the menswear try on haul. I'm going to give my summary uh, next, but so far guys, I feel like I'm going to be stealing my husband's wardrobe and thank God he has such amazing taste, which is very much in line with mine, which is just elevating your basics and just jazzing it up with a bit of flair thrown in, of course, with your florals and little accents, but it's fun, acceptable, sociable, interesting, yet, comfortable and that is the main thing guys i am very very comfortable but i also feel very very stylish and put together at the same time okay so i'm a little bit down i'm just about to start pulling things out of the wardrobe i've just tried on my husband's uh clothing haul for a video and let me tell you his wardrobe is putting me to shame right now i'm looking at my wardrobe being like what do i wear like i have clothes to wear but you know what do i wear I'm kind of been put to shame. I'm feeling a bit defeated. I might just be wearing my husband's clothes. I mean, lucky he's coming up for a week. <laughs> anyway, let's get the party started. I'm going to tip everything onto the bed, pack it away, and I think I will go through what I am bringing with me on my um, journey when I get there because that makes a bit more sense. In the meantime, I'm loving this little lighting situation. This is working. I might try this again. I wish I could just have it in a spot where you can't see it. But for now, it's working. You can see my face. Well, my lovelies, I do hope you enjoyed uh, this video of me trying on items from the menswear. I was more than impressed and more than surprised so I think now when I go shopping, and this is going to make my life extra hard, I now am going to be shopping also not only in the women's wear section but the men's wear section.
connection as well because clearly from the haul that I have had with my husband's wardrobe um, I am more than impressed and more than welcome to shop in a section that has comfy clothes well tailored clothes and very on trend clothes uh, I highly recommend this experience so anyone out there that is wanting to extend their wardrobe go shop in the menswear now I'm going to sign off here anything that I have featured in this video will be linked in the description box so do go and check it out and I hope you enjoyed and if uh, you want to be seeing more of this give it a thumbs up I actually think I'm going to do it again whether you like it or not okay I'm just putting it out there <laughs> Anyway, until then, my lovelies, uh, take care, stay safe, and I will see you in my next video, whatever that may be. All right, ciao, ciao for now. Bye. Bye, 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 bye.